Hey everyone, and welcome to my channel and to another episode of my $10 Tuesday series where we see what we can find for $10 or less. And today I'm really excited to be opening more spooky cute items with the new Series 3 Daddy Bears Mystery Mini Plush. I didn't even know Series 3 was coming out this soon because they just released Series 2, so I was really surprised to find these at 5 below for $5 each, and they look like a very cute lineup. There's six new Daddy Bear characters to collect. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. We're a collector hobby and review channel. And of course, if you like what you see, feel free to subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started. I really like the look of the coffin box. It has a cool purple and blue design. And look at our bears struggling to get out. Oh, this guy looks like a lot of fun. So again, six ones to collect. And we have Dr. Bear Grave. Oh, he's in, looks like a lab coat. That's kind of cool. Oh, our ultra rare is Gutsy Bear. Oh gosh, I think that's Gutsy. Oh, I am so curious about these Diddy Bear demises. We have Drips. <laughs> okay. We have Doodle Bear. Oh, he's cute. He's that one. He looked a little crazy. We have Skidmar. Oh no. He got ran over. He has tire treads on him. Oh my goodness. And then we have, I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. I'm going to assume like Bulgy Bear? Bulgy Bear? Either way, I like the colors. It's, it's that guy there. So I'm so excited to see who we get. It's a fun lineup. And their little stories are always very, very humorous. So inside we have, oh! I think we have Gutsy. <laughs> oh, yikes. Okay, so, you know, you, you can see inside Gutsy. Oh my goodness, look at the teeth though. That's pretty cute. There's there's his chest cavity and heart. Oh, skeletal back, his brains. Oh my goodness. So here, here we go. Gutsy Bear, he's 20 seconds of March before time began. Okay, so he, um, he he's old. <laughs> Gutsy Bear has a long, interesting story. So here we go. This bear was living his best life until he saw something in the sky heading straight for him. This thing we know as the Big Bang. Oh, okay. Which wiped out all the dinosaurs. Gutsy Bear was last seen standing on a rock beside his pet Diplodocus, tiny, with his chest out bravely towards their oncoming destroyer. Oh, that's kind of sad. He smells like dried fish guts. Okay. Loves big green spaces, and his weakness is loud noises. Aw, poor Gutsy Bear. He's, he's had a rough time. Okay, as for our next one, I'd be happy to see anybody. <laughs> they're all, they're all going to be amusing. They all have a, a, a wee bit of dark humor. <laughs> and our second one is... <gasps> oh, we have Doodle Bear. Oh, look at him. <laughs> Okay, he's pretty funny. I like the the marker looking outline of somebody just drawing or scribbling on him. Very curious to see his story. With the little squiggly marks. Okay, and Doodle Bear's story is as crazy as he looks. So his death date was the 11th of January, 1967. And it says, This bear had finally gotten his big TV acting break in 1967, and moments before he was due to begin, color TV was introduced, forever leaving black and white behind. Doodle Bear got so angry, he scribbled all over his perfect lines, forever destroying his perfect bear look. He was last seen jumping from camera to camera, sparks flying, and people screaming. Okay. He smells like a video film. He loves silent movies and his weakness is color. So the people screaming part is an interesting touch. <laughs> Feel free to let me know your thoughts on the new series, Three Daddy Bears, or out of the six characters, which one would you be most interested in finding? You can leave me a comment down below. As for me, these are always a lot of fun. I do like Gutsy Bear, and I would really like to see Skidmark. There's something really wrong about it, but it, he's, he's cute too. And that'll do it for this episode of my $10 Tuesday series. I do hope you enjoyed it or found it useful for your own shopping. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up, and I want to thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.